So the Raiden Shogun is taking action. Who would have thought? Uh, I feel like this is a bad idea, but I'm gonna teleport the Kamehameha up to a state. Oh god, whoa, 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 whoa. Also, am I, be am I being a bit too quiet for to you guys? I'm sorry. Like, if I if I seem a bit too quiet, it's because I'm just trying to, like, analyze everything, you know? It's hard to analyze and focus on everything at once, you know, if you know what I mean. Oh god. Oh, their base is a dungeon. Let me guess, I got to use Rider Shogun here. Think of a reason anyone would want to build a structure like this deep in the mountains. Maybe to evade detection. I feel something that doesn't belong here. I sense danger. Huh? We should proceed with caution. The Kujo clan descendant may well be in trouble. Where's Sala? Say hello to Raiden Shogun. Her search weapon is the okay. I don't think I'm sorry. I'm sorry, ma'am. She her search weapon is the engulfing lightning. This very same knocking out that she used against us during the all during all three Raiden Shogun fights. We also know that she has an electro vision, not a gnosis, because we know about her gnosis being not taken but given to Yai, who gave it to Scaramouche. <laughs> She has Baneful, Baneful Omen, and Musou Shinsetsu. We will see them in action later on. Constellation 3. Interesting. 60% of the opponent's defense is crazy, by the way. And with electric characters, they use Emerald Burst to resolve gain. Okay. That's what they do a burst. Her set is Noblesse Oblige, which is, in my opinion, the poor set for her because I think there was a much better set that she could use. But I get it, Elmo the Burst is her signature. Okay, why did you just look at me like that? I've done nothing to you. And, and of course, straight level 90. Not that bad stat. Let's see her in action. Using her E will actually build up to her burst later on when she builds that up. She's a very burst type of character, as such, can be kind of hard to play as. You think? Okay, yeah, right. Then you have a point here. You get to play. You get to take this fight seriously. And now it's time for her to use her ultimate move. Now you shall the Musono Shitotachi. There's actually a lot to bring out her katana only for a temporary moment. A lot to make her move lightning fast. But she's back from knocking out again. And it's not just that, but it's also not just that, but recommend that they use this ultimate skill. After several ultimate skills that has AoE effects, like Shang Ling's Pyronado or Kaya's Ice Shield. Cause it beautifully combos elemental wise with those. Did you just try to hurt the Red Shogun? My lucky day. Illusion shattered. So Vengeance you're gonna be US right be here. We saw Shinsa too. If you cannot tell, as an Archon, she is very busted of a character to play as. Also, I'm sorry, my mouse just kept on screwing over. Also, by the way, it, by the way, for a little bit of a fun fact, what is up with my mouse? A bit of a fun fact, if you keep using her E, 
If we keep using her E, she slowly builds up that builds up that ring that we saw that that we know that she owns. Or the or the ring that she has when you fight her as a boss. Which is kinda funny. Yeah, if you cannot tell I like full armor characters. Full armor characters are fun as well, yeah. This was Shinsa too. Also, with the Musona Hisatachi being activated, all of her all of her attacks are elect are electron fused, meaning meaning elemental reaction combos. Illusion shattered. Now you shall perish. You see, as you can tell, she's doing the overload damage. And look at that, Xiao Ultimate just charged, just charged immediately. But she's still to come. She's still taking too much damage. Let's leave it to us for here. And he's down. Don't touch that electro floor, it's gonna shock you. Now we need everyone's power, so where the shogun time for Let's heal you up real quick. Let's heal up Shell. Let's look who tell. Okay, I'm sorry, my mouse keeps freezing from this one. I don't think it's even I don't think it's dead. Okay, you're in a perfect situation. For me. One, two, three. Look at that damage, though. You can see now why you want to combo that with other elements too. First, because elemental reactions is a thing. And in her elemental burst can charge up fast if you have the perfect setup. That's what I consider the true power. Fitting for the Electro Arc on herself. Also, she looks really pretty. God, that's just like a. I will deal with this. Okay, eh? You do you, girlfriend. Almighty Shogun! Shogun? What are you? Descendant of the Takatsukasa clan. Explain what is going on here. Oh, we're just discussing some minor issues that have cropped up in the Tenryo Commission recently. Really, it's nothing worth the Almighty Shogun worrying about. And these minor issues warranted the secluded location and the hiring of Ronin and Kairagi to keep guard? Well, uh, uh, there's been a lot of turmoil lately. It was just out of security considerations, that's all. Silence. Descendant of the Kujo clan. Your turn. All right. I came here intending to negotiate, but it turned out all they were interested in was a written confession from the Kujo clan. A written confession? Yes. A statement acknowledging every crime committed by the Kujo clan since the inception of the Vision Hunt Decree, including all the recent misconduct. All factual statements, of course. Not a single one of them fabricated. I can't deny that. But it also emphasizes the Takatsukasa clan's achievements throughout the document, claiming they stood steadfast all along and fought back against the crisis. These are all falsehoods. Says who? Why, you two-faced... You're going back on everything you said. I'm just stating the facts. I'm sure the Almighty Shogun can discern the truth. All the Takatsukasa clan is trying to do is make themselves look good, so they'll be first in line to replace the Kujo clan. Why else would you push a false narrative in the written confession that paints your clan in a good light and try to make me sign it under duress? What are you talking about? You're not under duress, we're just negotiating here. You've completely changed your tune. I believe I now understand the situation. Don't listen to his nonsense. I'm sure you're well aware of the major failings of the Kujo clan. 
Surely you of everyone knows. Not a single word they say can be trusted. <laughs> you are quite mistaken if you think your dispute is of any interest to me. Descendant of the Takatsukasa clan, you wish to become the new Tenryo commissioner. Do I understand this correctly? Uh, well, y yes, of course. It's the eternal pursuit of everyone in the Tenryo Commission to offer our lives in service of the Almighty Shogun. Then the situation is not as complicated as you seem to have made it. After all, I am the one who appoints the Tenryo Commissioner. The process is quite simple. Anyone who can beat me in a duel becomes the new Commissioner. Uh, sorry, a duel with the Almighty Damn. Shogun? The first Tenryo Commissioner demonstrated his will with the blade in his hand. That is why the title has been passed down within the Kujo clan ever since. If you want me to appoint a new clan, then naturally, there must first be a new duel. I, uh... Do you not know how to wield a blade? Or do you simply doubt your abilities on account of your advanced age she knows and where, declining She knows where the condition. hit where it hurts. Here you are talking about offering your life, and yet you are too afraid to face my blade. Uh... Well... Well, never mind. What about one of you, then? Anyone who can defeat me, Takatsukasa or not, will be appointed the new Tenryo Commissioner. Uh, 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 uh. Does not a single person dare to face me? <sighs> I... I will challenge you, Almighty Shogun. What? Descendant of the Kujo clan. Regrettably, even if you win against me, it cannot atone for the wrongs committed under the Kujo name. I realize that. I don't stand a chance of winning against you anyway. I know full well that the mistakes my father made ought to spell the end of the Kujo clan's legacy in the Tenryo Commission. Even when I was executing the Vision Hunt Decree, I had doubts about my father's decisions. I knew that what I was doing was wrong, but that was as far as I went. I doubted, and I ruminated. I understood the situation perfectly well, but I took no action, and I didn't save a single person. I accept the Kujo clan's decline as punishment for my deeds. I can't even say that I failed to prevent it, because in order to fail, you have to have at least tried. To be brutally honest, for someone of your strength, there is nothing you could have done, even if you had tried. Yes. I'm too weak. My father ignores me. My elder brother can't help me. And I even need Ipe to set me straight at times. It's the way it's always been. But if nothing else, then right here, right now in the Kujo clan's final hours, it is I who represent the clan, like my father before me. His duties are now mine to perform. Just as the Shogun said, a forefather of mine once showed his will with his sword. Then please, let me, Kujo Kamachi, end the story of the Kujo clan in the same way that it began. This is my last chance to do so. What about Sada? This is patently meaningless. But I accept. Come forward. <laughs> 